This cute little earring is our Try It Tuesday for April 5th. We're calling it the Super Loop uh, earring. And it, I'm going to show you maybe some ways you hadn't thought of to use leather and the wax linen. So for supplies, you're going to need some leather. I'm going to show you a different color scheme. You're also going to use a little bit of wax linen. We're going to use um, some imitation rhodium findings. These are leverback earrings. We're also going to use foldovers. That's what this little bit is here. It's a nice way to finish leather. And then the last thing is we're just going to use some Edo seed beads for the little bottom part. So to get started, I'm going to cut my leather and you want to measure. It's not so much important that you do exactly like the example, but you do want to make the two earrings consistent. So I'm going to cut three inches for each earring. That way you won't be lopsided when you put them on, if you measure. And the first thing we're going to do is create the hoop part. We're going to put it in our fold over. So you're going to take your leather and fold it up. You're going to lay the two pieces together inside your fold over. And we're going to use our chain nose pliers to fold one side of the fold over down and then the other. So you have to come at it at kind of an odd angle, get it started. And once you've got it started, you can come across, just flatten it all the way down. And the second side can be a little tricky sometimes, it wants to roll on you. But that's what you're going for. So I'm going to go ahead and do my second one and then I'll show you how to put your little taily bits on there. Alright, I've gone ahead and done my second uh, earring. And I've already done one of my little dangles. So I'm going to show you how to do these guys. You're going to take a little piece of wax linen. I'm using about five or six inches. Um, seems a little wasteful, but you've got to have enough to actually get your knot tied or it's going to make you kind of crazy. But you're going to take your piece of linen and go through the loop like that. And I've just been lining it up and since it's waxed, you can kind of mush it together and make it a little sharper. And we're going to take both pieces pulled together through a seed bead. And it's a tight fit, so you might have to be patient. You can also cheat and use a pair of pliers. Which I guess isn't really cheating, it's just using a tool. So you're going to push your bead down to the leather. And then what we're going to do is tie an overhand knot, that's what this guy is, just below the bead. So I'm going to take both strands and make a loop and go around and through, like I'm tying a balloon. And when I tighten it, I want to kind of keep my fingers there and pull the knot down below the bead. You don't want to end up with it way down here. And you can tighten it up. And then part of the look is to leave a little bit of the tail sticking off. So you're going to trim it. Oop. 
and leave that little tail sticking off. So you're going to go ahead and do one more on here and your three on the other and I'll show you how to put on your ear wires. It took me a few minutes but I got all my little dangles tied on there. So the last thing to do is just attach our lever backs and this is actually fairly quick because the lever backs have a little slit right here. We're going to take our chain nose pliers and just kick it to the side a little bit. And when you put them on, you want to make sure the pretty side of your fold over is facing forward. And then just bring it back together. And there you go. Repeat on the other one and you've got a cute summery pair of earrings. You can pretend like it's already warm outside.